home for Christmas. You can count on me. Please have snow and mistletoe. Presents by a tree What's there, everybody? Christmas Eve You find me With straw I glee Is that considered a blue or is that considered off key? Hmm. I don't know. Hey, yo, what's up, guys? What do you mean it's almost midnight? It's 1247. If only in my dreams. Yo. Yo, 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 yo. So. A lot of you may be wondering, where the fuck has Jay been? Well, Jay has been working on his album. That's Cap. I've I've been, well, I've been doing my album. And I've also been taking care of company stuff, tidying up some knots. And I've uh, spent most of my time on GTA RP. Now... The problem with GTA RP No Pixel for me is one thing and one thing only. Listen up, fellas. It's one thing and one thing only. I play video games to get away from drama and to get away from my frustrations, okay? That city is full of drama and frustration. Am I drunk? No, but I really, really wish I was. I was trying to order alcohol earlier. Because I don't drink that often, so I don't have alcohol in my house. But, uh, there was no alcohol. So, yeah. So, that's, that's my whole spiel. Too many toes to tip on. Too many toes being tipped. Dude, no pixel is just so much drama, bro. It's just like, God. It's such a... It's a great game, though. It's... I think it's... You know what's funny? I think the developers of 5M and no pixel and the people who run it do a better job of running like a modded server than Escape from Tarkov does on running a fucking full-fledged company game. It just doesn't make any sense to me how the level of incompetence can be that low for a company that's made millions and millions of dollars and how how the level of competence can be so high for a team that's obviously made money but is also doing it as a passion project it just doesn't make any sense thanks for the live it's just my birthday happy birthday sorry i'm just ranting about stuff not drunk but like drunk i do yeah yeah well what game do you want to try next i really want to get good at gta like i i want to i want to join the the racing scene that's all i've been wanting to really do i don't really care about anything else like the heist like the bank stuff like okay that's cool it's fun like but it just it just feels like a chore until 
I can afford a car and then can start racing. You know, that's that's what I really want to do. I want to like get good at like. Vroom, 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 vroom. I want to. I need a racer name, guys. Does anyone have a good racer name for me? Like, uh, someone's racer name is Zeus. You alone? Yeah. I'm just at my house. Sorry, the lights are off. Yeah, I've seen your clips from GTA. Yeah, that's all. That's all like semantics until I get my car, dude. Like, I just I have no intention. You know, like all the heists and and like the the guns and the the pushing materials and stuff. Like, it's fun. Yeah, but honestly, it's more about just like the comedy and people just having a good time and the RP scenarios are fun. And I really like those, and I think I like. I think I'm really, really, really gonna like the racing. Like I'm not, I'm not into like I'm not NGTA to pew pew and grata ta 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 all over the place. You know what I mean? Like okay, to make it simple, I don't think I've ever played a game this long with this much self control on who to shoot. I don't think I've fired a single shot out of my gun, and I've had like hundreds. I have never. Shot at someone in the game. Because I know that there's fucking politics that come with it. And I just don't want to have... To, I wouldn't touch that with a 10-foot pole. It's so annoying, dude. I'm just I'm just there to vibe and not be part of drama. And I just always get dragged into it. Like, bro, I have not been in drama. Drama llama in my life since since like high school. Like, since college, I've been just chilling, binge chilling, just like, you big chilling, right? But as soon as I get in the server, I get tangled with all kinds of who's it's and whatnots and gizmos aplenty, fucking little mermaid bullshit. And, like, I'm just stuck there. Like, I, I don't understand. I don't know, dude. It's just so fucking dumb. But yeah, GT has been... It's been fun. It's been really, really funny. Like, dude, some people on that server are so good at doing roleplay. Like, they are so funny. Like, actually... I actually just... Okay. So GTA is the game that I found where I can finally sit down and watch someone. I usually can only watch... Like compilation, like clip compilations of people, right? Because it's, I don't know what it is for me, but watching Twitch just straight up is kind of cringy. For, at least to me. That's how it feels to me. <laughs> I'm not drunk. I'm completely sober, guys. And it's hard for me to watch people. But dude, like, 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 like Anthony Z, Blau, Buddha, like, dude, they are so funny. Especially, especially Tony, dude. I fucking, I die watching Tony. Like, that man is a walking jukebox of content. Like, I just, he's just, I'm always entertained watching his stuff. He's either being, he's either just role-playing his ass off and just, like, naturally talented at being funny. Or he's just going crazy on the sticks driving a car. Like, like, d wow, like, I just, I aspire to be that level of content someday. He is so funny. He is so funny. Like, I just, I just don't understand, like, how he comes up with some of the things that he does. Yeah. And I've been learning. I've been learning. GTA is really fun. No, you are drunk. I really am not. Um, but yeah, GTA, the whole thing is like, I think it's really, really interesting. The dynamic of how people like socialize and become friends and, you know, like, and it's all role play. So like, let's say you have a, you have a, I don't know, you have a friend and you're super mad at them. It's all role play. At the end of the day, you go back, you fall out of it and you realize that, oh, we're not actually our characters. We're not actually mad at each other. You know what I mean? So that's kind of interesting too. Like I've seen people in like relationships in a roleplay server or in uh, in NoPixel. 
And then, like, out of the server, they have nothing to do with each other. Like, I think that's such an interesting dynamic that it's so interesting to the point where I don't understand it well enough that when I get into the game and when I leave, I've been in, I've been in Los Santos, which is a city and the setting of GTA RP, that for so long that I forget what's real and what's not. And like the consequences of certain things. Okay, so like the other day, for example, I got into some drama with a label called MDM, right? Because I'm I'm signed to a label called Wu Chang in the game. And I was more stressed about that than all the stuff that's happening in real life, like wh- where everyone's mad at me on Twitter or whatever. I was more stressed about that. And then I really thought about it. And I was like, bro, this is consuming my life. Do I have prior on NoPixel? Yeah, I do. This is actually consuming my life. I, bro, like, it was, it was, it was, it was, it it just feels like real life. If if that makes sense, yeah, MDM MDM Records, yeah, it it feels like it feels like real life almost. It's so strange. It's so strange. No, like you guys, I don't, I don't. It's really hard to understand unless you you play the game and you get really into it. But once you're into it, like it just it almost feels like. You're living two separate lives and you're switching in and out. Because it feels so real. And all the social connections that you make and friends that you make in the game and enemies and whatever. It feels so real. It feels so, so real emotionally. But then once you hop off the computer, you realize, oh shit, that was, okay, that wasn't even that serious. It was just a fucking game. At the end of the day, it's a game. It's there for enjoyment, right? But, like, dude, like, it feels so real. It's so strange. It's so strange how, how real it feels. But anyway. Okay. Anyway, that's my wrap for the day. Um, Is there anything else I wanted to cover? No, not really. Isn't that exhausting? Well, kind of, because it's like it's like double emotional baggage, right? But then it's just it's just so strange. It's not strange. That means the game's good. Well, okay. So the thing is, the game could be good, right? But it just feels like it's it's not immersion. It's beyond that. It's like almost like. The game is more me than I am me. It's it's so weird. Kinda is Minecraft? No. Minecraft is Minecraft is a game. Minecraft is categorized as a game. GTRP feels like a lifestyle. Is I it will, uh, time ain't turning back my vision black 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 true. She was up, Alex. Do you use a voice changer in RP? No, I don't. It's it's so weird. It's so weird. <laughs> oh my god. Can you sing some verses from the Lotus remix? Uh, I don't know any you know, Lotus verses, but that hook goes so hard. That goes so hard. Like his demeanor, and like, ah, uh, shoot, what, what do you call that? His, uh, his energy, the way he, he, the way he recorded that vocally, just, it just feels so good. It's like very. It's very nonchalant, but like you, you know that they cut him. Like it just, it sounds perfect. It just sounds so good. 
Hey, yo, low, low key, low key. I don't think I've ever like, well, except uh, hmm. uh, except Purge. Like, because I've heard a lot of, like, higher music, AOMG stuff, and I've never, like, uh, you know, like, Jay Park's dope at rapping, but, like, not, like this one really stood out. As soon as he comes in with Appa Kabar, name is Jay Park, blah, 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 rip you apart, like, like, uh, that, uh, was just so sick, dude. I don't know how many times you recorded that, or if that was, like, you're really not drunk, dude. Yeah, I'm really not. Um, uh, but my name is Jay Far. Oh, that oh was just so like it just hit right. I don't know. Maybe it's just because I can't do any. I can't do stuff like that. I always go in the booth and try to sound hard sometimes, and I'm like, yo, this this song would sound, this song would sound so sick, bro. Like if I just like sounded a little bit like more hard and just like. You know, less less candy pop like I usually do, but I my voice just can't do it. But he nailed that. Oh, like I would never be able to record like that, hundred percent. But yeah, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Anyway, uh, I hope you guys are having a good one. Just wanted to check in with you. Get me in the booth. Oh, I got you, Lex. Anyway, I hope you guys have a good one. And then uh, I'll talk to you guys later. But if you guys want to see me or whatever, I'm I'm on a lot of I'm on a lot of uh, GTA RP streams. I think you guys could probably meet me there. It's it's so fun. It's so fun. Hey, but um, just know that my character is not me. Okay, my character is a character that I made that that I'm role playing. I don't condone any of the behavior, any of the words that that character says. Okay, just want to make that sure. Bro, you have to stream GTA soon. I t- I don't know if that's a move, man. I'm gonna be honest. I just don't feel like that is a smart decision. Oh, 